wanted to talk for a minute about a happier topic than some of my others. <clears throat> um, I wanted to talk about probably the best book that's ever been written from a standpoint of gaining personal freedom. And that's the book How I Found Freedom in an Unfree World by the American libertarian Harry Brown. Now, this book is relatively unique in that it gives a workable blueprint for attaining personal freedom. You see, most people don't really try to obtain personal freedom. They spend their lives complaining about the situation or not even trying to understand the situation. When you try to understand the world, one of the first things you'll see is that there are many structures of control that keep almost everyone in check and keep almost everyone repressed to some degree. And when people finally understand some of these structures of control, the first reaction is that they get very frustrated. And some people stay with that frustration for their entire lives. They just run around complaining about the system being fixed against them and there's nothing anyone can do about it. Unfortunately, those people are never going to obtain personal freedom. So then some of those people move on to the next stage, which is trying to rally everyone to reform the system. Well, you still haven't really taken personal responsibility for your life when you do that, though. Now you're trying to rely on other people to reform the system for you. You think that you need everyone else to be in on this reform before you can obtain your personal freedom. And that's a flaw as well. Now, the reason Harry Brown's book is so brilliant, in my opinion, is that <clears throat> He sees very clearly that personal freedom is something that only you are responsible for. And if you ever stop working for it, uh, you'll lose it. As our founding fathers said, the price of freedom is eternal diligence. You are the one responsible for obtaining your freedom. And it is possible. Because these structures of control that keep us trapped the banking industry, the government, the uh, different social institutions. These structures of control are large and slow. And that's why this book, How I Found Freedom in an Unfree World, is probably the most dangerous book ever written. Because it points out that the individual can always escape and circumvent these structures of control. We run around all of our lives thinking that we're trapped by various uh, institutions and, and things that we don't even understand. But if we try, we can understand them and we can escape them once we understand them. Because these institutions are large and they're slow. And as an individual, you can always learn ways to escape the control of these large, slow, oppressive institutions. You know, in my video, The Real Story of Money, I talk about how you can escape the exploitation of the banking industry. In my video, How the Media Works, I talk about how you can escape uh, manipulation by the mass media. There are always ways to escape these controls over your life. And once you realize that it's no one's responsibility but your own to gain personal freedom, then you can gain it. It just takes eternal diligence.